Okay, welcome back to Bermuda Grass Central. Guys, listen, before you swipe away, before you click away, somebody is going to win 50 bucks in their cash app. Stay tuned. So guys, some of you are saying, BYD, I don't want to put chemicals in my yard. I want to hurry up and kill poor. I don't want to pay $80, $100, $200, $300 dollars for a bottle of herbicide to kill these weeds. Guys, what you're looking at right here is poor. Now, this one is starting to die off from that red image, but I'm going to show you a way to kill this in three days, and it's only going to cost you a few bucks. So guys, let's just get straight to it. Guys, these are the natural ways of killing the weeds in your lawn without spending all that money. This formula right here, it's only gonna take maybe a day to three days for it to actually work. But there is a disclaimer. Okay guys, now using this formula to spot spray, I'm not saying blanket spray your yard doing this, only to spot spray on Bermuda grass, you're gonna have some lawn damage that's gonna be caused by it. Now, if you stay to the end, I'm gonna show you how to fix that one particular spot if you get any damage at all. Okay, Yard Finex, real easy to make, guys. The only thing you really need is some vinegar, some uh, dish detergent. doesn't matter. I don't care. Dawn, whatever the cheapest one you can find, most expensive one you can find, and a real heavy-duty sprayer, guys. And you just probably need a measuring cup. Now, remember, this formula is going to be a 1 to 4 ratio, which means for every so many ounces of this, I'm going to add four times the amount of water into this sprayer. I'm gonna use three ounces of this vinegar. Now you can use either one, just a word of caution. If mama see you using her weight loss formula uh, vinegar, you're gonna be in some serious trouble. Just like they said, that's your Mr. Postman. So be careful with that. And this stuff has mother in it. Sometimes that will clog up your sprayer. So that's why I said a heavy duty sprayer. Okay, and you see I already got the water on the inside here. We're just going to add three ounces of our yeah, vinegar. Next, look, I'm going to go ahead and piss off mama, so I'm, I'm going to use her weight loss formula right here, guys. And all I'm going to do is add three ounces of this into here. I already got 12 ounces of water in my spray bottle. Make sure you give it a good shake before you put it in there, guys. We're going to open it up. Put three ounces in here. What happens if you put more than three ounces? Nothing. Just bear in mind, the more of this acid, of this, this um, vinegar you put in there, the more potent it's going to be, and it could do more damage. So I would not spray 10 ounces of just straight vinegar on that. You wanna go ahead and dilute, dilute it. Okay, next, just go ahead and add that to your spray bottle. Guys, do not add salt to this. Okay, just use the natural vinegar. Do not add salt because the salt is going to make a bigger damage in that area. So pour that in there. You see that mother is kind of clumpy right there. We're going to shake that up. Okay, guys, last but not least, just get you some, some um, dish detergent. Now, you can get a real surfactant, guys. I am making a formula with stuff that's in that house. Most people got that. People on weight loss journeys, they got that right there. Most people got a cheap spray bottle and you are washing dishes, hopefully, in your home. So just get whatever uh, liquid dish detergent you can. That'll be fine. So BYD, how much of this dish detergent do I add? Generally, you, you, all you need is an ounce, guys. You don't even need that, guys. Half an ounce. But just use half an ounce or I'll just recommend half an ounce. That's all you need. Pour that in there. Now that you got it in there, just shake it up real good. Give it a real good jiggle because you're finna get ready to skeet it. And guys, before you use this, it may be a good idea to go ahead and put weed killer on the bottle so won't nobody make any mistakes. Okay guys, real easy to do. Just find your little pour. Make sure you got it on mist, not stream. Skeet it one time, and that's all you need right there. Now, in, in one to three days, you're going to see that die off. But this, it works on just more than the pour. Let me show you what else it works on. Okay, guys, this formula works on all weeds. One little skeet, that's it. 
Okay guys, if you got rock beds and somehow that Bermuda grass has gotten up in there because of those stolons, yeah, just keep, just keep it, skip it down real good. Anywhere you see a weed that you want to down your yard, just give it a little small skeet. Make sure it's on mist, guys. So even where you see these larger like planting type weeds or dandelions, one skeet, guys. Three All right, so in about later. three or four days, you see how that's starting to white, how it's starting to crinkle up? That's how your weed is going to look right there. Now, what happens if you damage the area? Let me show you how to fix that. Okay, so when that area is burned, guys, simply just get you some topsoil, mushroom compost, the Scott's uh, lawn soil. I don't care what it is. And you're going to see these sticks in it. That's not bad soil. That's how it comes, guys. And it's there for a reason. This breaks down also. But take it and just simply spread it in that spot right there. Now, what will happen? Those stolons over a period of time will start running back across that new soil and it'll fill that spot in so guys hopefully you stay to the end guys this side note when you do this make sure that you do this when you got at least three or four days where it's not going to rain you do not want to water that spot after you do this because you'll make it spread out and burn more grass that one skeet is going to have it concentrated the surfactant to help it stick to the weed and it'll start killing it off a whole lot faster. So make sure you don't water that spot for at least three or four days. Okay, now that you watch the video, you don't care enough about that. You wanna learn how to win this 50 bucks, guys. It's real simple, guys. You have to subscribe to the channel, all right? Subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, leave a comment, and leave your Cash App tag. Once I reach 50,000 subscribers, I am picking somebody in the comments from this video and I will cash up you 50 bucks to your cash up account. Okay, BYD, I don't have a cash up account. That's fine. Guys, I have a link down there. Click on my link, use my code, set up your cash up account. You get $5 once you use it. I get $5 once you use it. Plus, you have a chance to win 50 bucks. Guys, I'm giving away money all this season. So make sure you have a cash up account and subscribe to the YouTube channel, Bermuda Grass Central. Once so for again, the guys who like, man, I ain't spraying no vinegar in my yard. I wanna do it. What can I use this to go in the store and buy and spray my yard? Guys, click on this video right here. I have a playlist that shows you how to kill poor many different ways.